I'm going to show you how to perform a factory reset on your Samsung Galaxy Tab S8, S8 Plus, or the S8 Ultra. Now remember, for the factory reset, we will lose everything on here, all our personal information, our videos, our uh, photos, and whatnot. So if you have anything important, make sure you back it up. Also, once we're done with factory reset, we'll be able to have a clean slate, or we will be able to sell it, okay? So the first thing is this, we want to go to settings, so we're going to scroll up, we're going to go to our settings right here, and then from here on the left pane here, what you want to do is scroll all the way down to the very, very bottom down here, it says about tablet. Tap on about tablet, and now on this side we want to scroll all the way down to the very bottom, it says reset. Let's go ahead and tap on reset right there, and now we want to tap on factory data reset. So let's tap on that right there. Now, this is very important, okay? It says all data will be erased from tab, including all my Google account's gonna be gone, all of this is gonna be gone. Now this is where it becomes pretty important. It says right here, you are currently signed into following accounts and it shows one of my Gmail accounts, okay? So, the thing is, if we scroll all the way down and if I reset right now, do the factory reset, eventually during the setup process, I'm not gonna be done setup unless I remember the email address that I had synced to my email app on my tablet here. So I will have to eventually remember this Gmail account that I had synced and also the password to that to complete the setup, all right? So if you're going to sell this tablet, you need to get rid of this. Also, even if you want a clean slate, like what I do when I do factory reset, I delete this too, because I have like 20 different email addresses and I forget that this is the email address that I use, and then I forgot the password, and I can't complete the setup, okay? So what I recommend is deleting this first. So we need to delete this Gmail address. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go back over here, and then, so go over here, and then we're gonna scroll down, and we're gonna look for Google Services. Let's tap on that right there. Now it says my Gmail address right here in the Google. It says my Gmail address right here. Now what I want to do is click on this right arrow right here. Let's tap on that right there. And then from here, I'm going to tap on Manage Accounts on this device. Tap right there. And now, here's again, here's my uh, Gmail address right here. Let's tap on that. And what we're going to do is remove it, okay? So we're going to tap on Remove Account. Remove Account. We're going to click on OK down here. Oh, gotta verify my fingerprints here or it's asking for a password. Okay, now look, the email address is gone. So now if I if we go back to the about tablet and then scroll down over here, we'll go back to reset, and then we'll tap on factory data reset. Now you can see that email address is no longer in here. So now I'm gonna go ahead and factory reset it, tap on reset, type in your pin or password. After you print the password, we're going to tap on continue right there. And now we see right here, factory data reset. All your personal information and downloaded apps will be erased and cannot be recovered. Data that has been backed up to the SD card won't be erased. You can restore SD card using the smart switch after reset, okay? So we're going to delete all and we're going to go ahead and proceed. So now it's shutting down. All right, it just turned off. Now it's booting back up and it's gonna be stuck on the Samsung um, Galaxy logo for a little bit. And voila, we are back in business. So from here for myself, I can start back over with a setup process with a clean slate, or I can just go ahead and sell it right now, all right? Good luck, guys.